I want to make one quick statement. I, I find it very offensive that anybody would compare uh, any federal employee, frankly, to uh, someone who uh, the Gestapo or uh, running Nazi concentration camps. That is very offensive. I have 15 seconds and I yield it to you. Thank you for saying that. I wish somebody in Democratic leadership would say that out loud. Look, you want to know why there's 50,000 people in detention? You want to know why we have a million, million, one million illegal entries in the United States? You want to know why we have these issues? Because you have failed to secure the border. You have failed to work with this president to close the three loopholes we've asked for two years to close. I'm so if you want to know why this issue expired. exists, you need to look in the mirror. You, need, the you have failed American expired. people who are not Holman. securing the border and closing the loopholes. Mr. Holman, look, please respect the chair and the authority you know, of the chair. The time have, of the gentleman has expired. I've asked you gentleman politely to let me go beyond my, my time, and you let other people go beyond their time, but not, not to Tom Holman. He don't get me go have, beyond his time. Mr. Holman, we have this, this approved is a, this is, this is an circus. agreement this is between circus. the Republicans and the Democrats with the ranking member. We increased the time of one witness, uh, one uh, member of Congress who was interrupted by a protest. That is done with the approval of the ranking member. Please respect the chair's authority. The I respect woman, the chair's the authority, but the chair... Mr. Holman! The, the, you work for me. me. I'm a taxpayer. I'm a taxpayer. You work for me. The witness will suspend. Thank you. Um, and with that, we do conclude today's hearing. Uh, I would like to say that the truth is our country is far too reliant on the incarceration of immigrants. The beneficiaries are for-profit prison companies, but we do have sensible, humane, cost-effective solutions that would be provided under my bill, the Dignity for Detained Immigrants Act. And I do think it's unfortunate, I'll just uh, could say chair, before would we conclude, yield? that I do think that it's Point unfortunate... Is the, is the committee over, or is it a time for another five-minute round? No, it's not a time for then another five-minute round. it's time to adjourn the committee, Madam Chair. Grant, I just said to the ranking member of the subcommittee that I was going to make one brief statement. But as the ranking member of the committee, I'm calling a point of order and saying it's time to end this committee. Okay. Well, I would like to say that I hope that witnesses called by the minority in the future respect the authority of the committee. I wish the committee chair right now would recognize the fact that she's like supposed to, to be calling this committee. There's again, not five minutes extra. Thank you, Mr. Collins. I would once again like to thank the panel of witnesses and particularly those who traveled far away to be with us today. Without objection, all members will have five legislative days to submit additional written questions for the witness or additional materials for the record. Without objection, the hearing is adjourned.